And back here in Chicago, the city council also decided to defer a vote today on police discipline. So the police union went to court this afternoon. NBC 5's Patrick Fazio has more from City Hall. FOP President John Catanzara and other members of the police union walked out after the city council deferred a vote on how to discipline police. Order Woman Harris, just a moment, please. The vote was deferred, although a council committee decided 10 to 5 yesterday to recommend a vote. The public has demanded accountability, and in order for us to have that confidence in our police and build the systems necessary to have community engaged, in violence prevention efforts. The council was supposed to vote on a ruling that says police disciplinary cases can be heard by a third party arbitrator instead of by the police board. We need to improve accountability, transparency. The police board does that. Independent arbitrators have not. The FOP is not asking for anything that any other public employee gets in this state. Everybody else has the opportunity to go to arbitration. The police union says state law is on their side. Well, this goes back decades under the, the, uh, the Labor Act, and it was very clear that in lieu of the ability to strike, police and fire would get interest arbitration to resolve all contractual issues. After the council refused to vote, the FOP went back to court today to ask a judge to intervene. They're going to let the judge do the dirty work because even the no votes know that this is legally sound. This is an ongoing case from 2017, which already had a court hearing scheduled for this afternoon. And today, the judge ruled to delay any disciplinary action by the police board until February 24th, so the city council can vote on this issue. Reporting at the Daily Center, Patrick Fazio, NBC5 News. Our thanks to Patrick.